Hey guys and welcome to the Kenyan Supported Space. Nemanyara here. I hope you and your families are keeping as best as you can during this season. Well, it's Madaraka Day and for those of you who've been working, either actually going to work or working from home, this is a great day to rest as well as commemorate 57 years of Kenya's independence. Well, what better way to rest than as well to indulge in a healthy, nutritious meal, which is oatmeal. If you haven't noticed by now, I'm a great, great fan of oats, but I know that most people aren't because of the bland uh, feeling and taste. Um, so here are three in but very many ways of how to spruce up your oatmeal um, and make it uh, tasty and yum, as well as it being nutritious. Just to let you guys know as well, this is an archive video. Yes, guys, YouTubers do have old videos. And so, yeah, I'm showing it to you guys right now. So I hope that you enjoy it. If you do make it as usual, please take photos. Um, and yeah, have a great Madaraka day and let's keep praying. All right, guys, so as I said, there's so many ways of spicing up your oats, whether it's adding in your fruits, your nuts, your yogurt, spices, chocolate, whatever the case, oatmeal is something great to add into your diet just because of its awesome nutritional value. So here are some of the ways that I've been doing it personally. So go right ahead and take your one bowl of oats, a tablespoon of cinnamon, one apple, half a lime, or a quarter teaspoon of apple cider vinegar and go right ahead and cook your oats um, and right after that go ahead and dice your apples and proceed on to adding your toppings onto the oats so oats have a number of benefits number one they are gluten free for people like us who are gluten intolerant they lower cholesterol levels uh, as well as controlling blood sugar levels um, their feeling effect can help with weight loss and also they relieve constipation. So this along with cinnamon uh, helps fight anti-inflammatory uh, uh, conditions and as well as lowering blood sugar levels. So this is a really, really great meal to have. So go ahead and add in one tablespoon of honey just for that extra sweetness. There we go guys that is our final result looking all nice and tasty and yum so for the second one go ahead and get your one bowl of oats one banana two tablespoons of peanut powder one tablespoon of black sesame seeds so go ahead and cook your oats and add in some peanut powder or as well you could add in a handful of groundnuts or peanuts slice in your banana and then pour in your sesame seeds. So this one is a really, really great one just after a workout because it is packed with protein um, because of sesame seeds and peanuts being a great source of plant protein, as well as it is uh, a good source of fiber which supports digestive health. Right there is our final result. guys so for this last one go ahead again and get your one bowl of oats one and a half teaspoons of cinnamon three tablespoons of pumpkin seeds and an inch of turmeric okay so guys i completely completely forgot to take a shot of me doing a banana turmeric pudding but it is as simple as it sounds all you need to do is get your one inch of turmeric, if it is whole, peel it and grate it or pound it. And then um, go ahead and get your pot, add in your slices of banana, put in a bit of water, mash it up, heat it on low heat and add in your grated turmeric. And just mix, mix, mix and it's going to be ready. And then we're just going to go ahead and uh, pour right into our bowl of cooked oatmeal. Um, and then pour in the rest of the toppings and we are good to go and for this one uh, Pumpkin seeds are rich in zinc, which is good for your skin recovering from cold and Magnesium which is found in pumpkin seeds once again is also good for heart health and it is also loaded with omega-3 fatty acids and the banana here also helps in digestive health and it also helps us feel fuller for longer uh, which gives us that fulfilling uh, and helping in weight loss 
and it is also an athletic food um, as it reduces on muscle cramps and soreness so go ahead and enjoy this one go ahead and add in your honey and it is ready to eat that is the final result